With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. So hello everyone. In this question, we have to find the quadratic polynomial whose sum of zeros is 5 and product is 6. So we have to find the zeros of polynomial. So first of all, what we have to do? Let us assume that alpha is equal to alpha and beta are the two zeros of quadratic polynomial. So let's write let zeros be alpha and beta. Now sum of zeros is given as 5. So alpha plus beta is equal to 5 and product is given as 3 means alpha beta is equal to 6. So now we have to find the quadratic polynomial. So let's write the quadratic polynomial form that is px is equal to x square minus alpha plus beta into x plus alpha beta. So this is the form of quadratic polynomial. So let's cover it into a box. So this is the form of quadratic polynomial. Now what we have to do? We have to just put the values of alpha and beta. Alpha plus beta and alpha beta. So x square minus 5x plus 6. So this is the quadratic polynomial px. Now we have to find the zeros of quadratic polynomial. So for finding zeros, we have to equate px equal to 0. So for finding zeros, so px is equal to 0 for finding zeros. So from here what we have to do, just write the equation that is x square minus 5x plus 6 is equal to 0. Factorize this polyno polynomial. So x square minus 3x minus 2x plus 6 is equal to 0. So taking x as a common x minus 3 minus 2 x minus 3 is equal to 0. So x minus 3 and x minus 2 are two factors of this quadratic polynomial. So now from here what we have to do just equate all part equal to 0. So from here we have find x is equal to 3 and from x minus 2 part we have find x is equal to 2. So these are the two zeros of quadratic polynomial. So let's write our answer in separate lines. So first of all let's write quadratic polynomial. So px is equal to x square minus 5x plus 6. So this is our quadratic polynomial first answer and uh, zeros of quadratic polynomial. So let's write zeros of px that are equal to 3 and 2. So these are two zeros. This is our second answer. So let's highlight our answers and thank you so much. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.